Yo, what is up guys and welcome back to another Mythic Heroes video. In today's video, we are going to be doing the Empyrean Astrolobe event and I will be telling you guys if you guys should spend your diamonds on this or if you guys should skip it. Without further ado, let's hop straight into it. So the very first thing you'll notice when you click on the event is going to play a short animation so you can see what the skin is like. If you already know what the skin is like, you can just go ahead and skip it and it'll take you to this page right here. So um, the, one of the things you'll notice is you'll see that there's different pointers and then there's also um, Nova Star gems and diamond spins. So if you click on this button right here, you can choose how many pointers you would like. Um, maximum amount of pointers you can pick at a time is three. And the first 10 um, spins you do are going to be at a 50% discounted rate, both for diamonds and Novas. So me personally, I don't think it's really worth doing this event with Novas. However, if you really like the skin and you um, don't have any diamonds left, I suppose it's fine. But uh, yeah, so I'm going to do my first three spins right um, here. Hit 900. And it's going to go ahead, spin. And it landed on um, cubes, some um, antique chests, and the gold boosters. I'm not particularly fond of any three of these, but um, just go ahead. Three more spins, and we get um, some scrolls, some more gold, and um, more cubes. Um, uh, and then let's do three more spins. So I'll let you guys know exactly how many diamonds it's going to take for me to get all of the stuff at the end of the video. If you guys want to stick around for that, um, let me know how many spins it, or how many diamonds or spins it took for you guys to get all of your stuff as well. So right now um, we've done nine of the discounted spins. So now the diamond spins are going to start costing extra, which is fine. Um, Three more spins and we get some more scrolls some more antique stuff and divinity um let's go ahead now it's going to start costing 1800 diamonds per three spins so that's what we get here more cubes more scrolls some more divinity don't really need much of either of those let's do some more spins and we get more gold and more divinity let's go on ahead um and this time we get the um, one of the jackpot prizes, which is going to be the Imperian Astrolobe uh, custom chest, which can give you um, some UR shards, or you can pick Inherited Divinity, one of the premium Muse vouchers, um, some Essence, some Pure Essence, or some of these um, Refining Stones or Infinity Soul Seals. For most people, I would um, suggest picking the Pure Essence as you are going to be extremely gated by that stuff. So yeah, as you can see, after we picked up one of those jackpots, um, the chances for getting it went away from the prize pool. Um, let's see what we get in this spin. We get some more gold, some antique stuff, more scrolls, just cool. Um, let's see what we get in this spin. We get more scrolls, more antique stuff. Now that we've gotten all of the scrolls, the chances to get the other prizes have increased, as you can tell by the um, increased slots. Um, get some more cubes and some more divinity. Let's go ahead, do some more spins, see what we get. Um, and this time we got the um, antique custom chests for the SSRs, which is pretty cool. And now that's out of the prize pool, the chances for getting the um, skin is going to be a little bit greater now. Go ahead, spin, see what we get. Some more um, mostly useless stuff. Hopefully it doesn't take me all the spins, that would be a bit unfortunate. But at this rate, it might honestly take that many spins. So we've done 39 spins so far. Let's do some more. And this time, no skin. Do some more spins right here. And we finally get the uh, skin, which completes the event. Um, got ourselves the, the uh, new Gabrielle skin. 
it took me 45 pointers to get the skin which um the first 10 of the summons were discounted at a rate of 300 diamonds per pointer so that was 3000 and then the next 35 pointers all costed 600 diamonds each which was a grand total of 21,000 diamonds for those pointers and if you add them up that it costs me 24,000 diamonds to get the skin and everything in the event which in my opinion is kind of expensive um, for most players if you do not like the skin I don't think you should be spending a lot of diamonds on this event but if you do like the skin I think it's fine to spend diamonds on this event as the skin will only be available for um, Nova's essentially after the event is over. So uh, yeah, that pretty much wraps up the video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.